I'm your boy, Ice Cream Man with the plan. And today is going to be a productive damn day. Oh, Master Pee Wee, nigga. No lemon tanks, it's my fuck. Uh, to start this off, uh, I just want to talk about uh, the same preseason. Um, it was a productive damn preseason, uh, but also they had some um, some things that they needed needed to clean up by the penalties to holding uh, on both sides, mainly the offensive line. Uh, I trust that we get that right, so I'm not going to stress on it. Uh, it was a good game, however, good game all around uh, for the preseason game against the New York Jets. So, I like to say that. And also, too, I like to talk about this uh, Andrew Luck situation. Uh, it don't got nothing to do with, uh, with the Saints, but it do got something to do with with just being a damn good football player at a short amount of time, no matter of what happened with him in our in the organization. But man, I just wanted to speak on it and I just wanna say this. Uh I think Andrew Luck by his retirement and if it's any coach fans, coach fans that that ever look at this video and I, I just need you to hear what I'm saying here. He making the right decision for him personally for his mental health. Uh, I watched his interview and I heard what he said. But however, I feel like it's the right decision to, you know, to try to, you know, just look at himself in the mirror. Just look at himself in the mirror and say, I need to make this decision for myself. Yes, it's true. Um, it looked like he is one of the rare talents, um, younger rare talents. And, man, to be honest with you, if he would have kept going, I have no doubt. I have no doubt that he would have wouldn't have been a Hall of Famer. Uh, Andrew Luck is a damn good uh, quarterback, and, and he well, man, he just deserved the respect that, you know, and then I kind of feel like he deserved more respect than he get. But, man, it, really, I have no words for it, bro. But I'm trying to, you know, but I'm trying to come from the heart here. You feel what I'm saying? So, I think he made a good decision that can help him. Um, however, uh, Coast fans, uh, I know some of y'all might be like, damn, man, you, you know, you're going to bail on us. But, you know, you got to look at it. No matter how good of a player they are, mental health is good. If you do not have that good mental health, then you pretty much just a you pretty much just a tool, man. Uh, you was you were just a using tool like you are like you will just be a tool uh, that has been used by the NFL, you know, and. Matter of fact, the way how he was said in the interview, he was a broken tool. You know, like he was a good piece, but a but a broken piece that's been broken. And, you know, like he need to refit himself, you know, for his mental and his physical health. Mental and physical health. That's what he said. Mental and physical health. First, it come mentally because it's like, you know, you can't really get over. Uh, I don't know if y'all know this. About injuries, the way how serious injuries work. Uh, yes, injuries is physical, but it also can affect you mentally. Um, so, so mental. When I was saying about mental, you know, all that goes down in the same boat. You know, he have to have that mental and that physical health to live his life the way he wanna live his life, and that's what he feel that you know by him playing football. He is not living the way he's want to live uh, healthy. So uh, I think he made the right decision for him. Uh, it's sad for him to go bye-bye, but 
Uh, I'm pretty sure he'll be missed by people who love the game of football. Uh, I show that he'll be missed by the Colts organization. And hopefully he returns in the future, you know. Like, hopefully he returns next year or the following year, whatever. But I really think he just needs to get himself together and, you know, physical and mentally wise. And that's what he's going for, you know. And that's just my opinion on it. But for all notice, uh, yeah, you know, like, that's what I have to cover today. I'm also planning on making some other videos uh, that's coming soon uh, for all the ones who going to be there, man. Look, just, just, look, just stay tuned, man. You know, uh, I'm hit you with some bangers. But for all notice, I'm your boy, Ice Cream Man, with the plan, man. We out.